Hello YouTube friends. I just wanted to show you how I have been packing my uh, Fossil Sydney satchel. This one is in black and it's in the Echo Leather which is pretty much just how they uh, raise the cattle in the uh, processing of the leather. So it still is looking great. It's softened up considerably uh, since I've been using it. I think I've had it about five months now. And I haven't used it tons, but I'm also not real careful when I store these. I don't really stuff them with a lot, and I just kind of keep them up on my shelf and not um, not in dust bags or anything. So the leather has softened up a lot. And that's one of the reasons why I opted to go for an organizer inside it, because it really helps keep the shape and it keeps things separate. And so I'll show you how great that works. So you can see it's getting real slouchy over here, which is great. I mean, I like these bags to definitely soften up. I have conditioned it, but like I said, I haven't had it that long or given it that much use. So it's softened up on its own really nicely. So let me show you how the speedy type of organizer works. And I'll try and put the link below for this particular one. But honestly, if you go on to Amazon and just type in speedy 25 organizer, you'll find a ton of them. It's just the standard organizer, but look how great that works in there. It fits perfectly. It's not even up over the gusset. It's just right at the gusset line. So it's just an absolute ideal fit for your um, Fossil Sydney or your Fossil Rachel satchels. Isn't that great? And then it keeps it nice and straight on the bottom. It's not going to have that slouch or anything hanging down underneath. So let me show you how I have it packed. And you also won't believe the amount that fits in here, although maybe you would since these are famous for being the clown car of bags. So I have a, just a journal planner in here and this is just a cheapy leather one I got from Amazon a long time ago, I'm not sure. But um, yeah, so that fits well and that's a pretty thick size. And then I don't have anything stored in the zippered pocket. This also has a pocket right here, so I could put glasses there, but I keep my glasses in this little pocket here, standing up. And then I am using my new, um, my new little um, Pez Basquiat card holder that came with a pouch set. And what I did is I clipped just one of these little o-rings on the side of it so if I want to clip it to a bag or inside a zippered area I can do so that works out really good and then it has the strap that detaches that also comes with it um, and I'll show you where I have that but it's it's working out great it holds quite a bit of cash inside and then four cards so I'm liking it. It's very soft and you can double up your cards very easily. There's plenty of room if you want to double them up. And then I have my Basquiat pouch and this is the one that I just kept the wristlet strap on. And then I'm using this one for all of my paperwork, insurance cards, things like that, gum, um, hair bands. It fits a lot. And it's been really great. So it's kind of like an extension of the card holder for a wallet. Got that in there. I have my little Heritage Turnlock pouch that I am using for hand sanitizer right now. Like that. Uh, just using this as a little makeup catch-all. So a little pochette in there. I have my little pouch with extra masks. I always have that with me. So you can see now it's emptying out quite a bit. And then actually I don't have anything else in the organizer, but you have lots of different slots here for different things. And then this center compartment does Velcro in and out, so you can easily take it out if you want it to be just a just a hole where you put everything. And then on the side pocket, I have my keys, my favorite little leather um, 
key case from Amazon. Worked out great for me. And, and the other one, I just have some tissues. So it really does keep the structure of your bag. And then I think when I um, excuse me, when I store my bag, I'm actually going to keep the organizer inside it from now on, and that'll kind of keep its shape. But really, it's uh, the perfect size for oops, I'm sorry, perfect size for speedies. I've used this, of course, in my speedies, uh, and apparently also for your um, Fossil Sydney or Rachel satchels. They work out really great. So I'm just going to put everything back in here, but I like how everything has its place now. I'm not just kind of layering it and then hoping it doesn't slouch. And then again in the back, I'm just going to put the planner and it fits perfectly. And I dropped my tissue. I'll put that over here. And then I had pochette on the side. There we go. So see, everything fits in there really nicely. And then it's still very easy to zip up, of course, because it's got the zippers that go all the way down on the sides. So anyhow, if you're looking for a great way to organize your Fossil Sydney or Rachel Satchels, I highly recommend getting a Speedy 25 organizer. Works out great, keeps a nice smooth line, and you can fit everything you need in there. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Until next time.